These are truly beautiful caves located in County Fermanagh in Northern Ireland. Having seen a few caves in my life, the thing that drew me to these was the boat ride. Before I go to that part, let me tell you a little about the cave tour. So you can only visit them through a guided tour. The price for this is £11. It lasts a little more than an hour and it's basically a loop. They take you to the entrance of the cave from one side and you come out of the other. If the boat journey is cancelled due to high levels of water, then it becomes a linear way where you walk and return the same way. the first one on hence I sat right at the front it was so amazing such an incredible experience that lets you get absorbed in the wonders around you the boat floated quietly as I studied the strange structures around me From time to time, the guide pointed out interesting facts, for example, the place where three rivers meet, the way the first explorers came, etc. Although the rest of the tour is also very interesting as you get to see so many cool formations and learn exciting facts about them, but I have to say that this boat journey was certainly the highlight of the tour. That feeling you get is unique. After I disembarked, the cave walk began which is roughly around 1 km. Pay close attention to what the guide says and you will get to learn some very cool stuff. For example, it takes 1000 years for a stalactite to grow 1 cm in length. There are also interesting names for certain things in the caves. For example, there is the Moses Bridge that separates one of the rivers into two parts. Just over this bridge lies the migraine rock. It's so called because of its ability to give you such a sharp headache if you hit your head. All of this does provide a fun twist to the tour. I started to spot what shapes I saw according to my imagination. Then at the very end, you have to climb 153 steps to get back to the visitor center. I highly recommend this tour. It's very well presented and has a good pace. Although I did get left behind a few times whenever I was trying to photograph something. But that did not take away from the unique experience I had in these caves. It's just raw nature around you, the very best kind. Then after the tour finishes, you can see a documentary about the caves and the geopark in the visitor center theater. Ahead of the Marble Arch Caves Visitor Center lies the Kalka Walking Trail, which is commonly referred to as the Stairway to Heaven, and very rightly so. I have a full post and video about it on my page, Travel is the Answer. Be sure to check it out if you are looking for more activities to do when in the area, or even if you are just on the lookout for expanding your bucket list. It's truly right out of a fantasy.